proof that the Bible is true. He placed rice into three glass beakers and covered it with water. And then every day for a month, he said, thank you to one beaker. You're an idiot to the second. And the third one, he completely ignored. After one month, the rice that had been thanked began to ferment, giving off a strong, pleasant aroma. The rice in the second beaker turned black. And the rice that was ignored began to rot. Dr. Emoto thinks that this experiment provides an important lesson, especially with regard to how we treat children. We should take care of them, give them attention, and converse with them. Indifference does the greatest harm. If we look in Psalms 18 verse 21, death and life are in the power of the tongue, and they that love it shall eat the fruit thereof. Your words cast spells. This is why they call it spelling. It's because words carry energy and vibration in the spirit realm that we can't see. This is also how they put demonic subliminal messages in front of the kids' faces. These are spells that open up demonic portals. So be careful what you say to yourself and be careful what you say to others. The power of life and death is in your tongue. So be wise with it. God bless.